now time to shed light on the situation. The Russian embassy spokesman said the proposal had been made in light of increasing tensions on the Korean Peninsula. Lavrov also said Russia was in close contact with the United States, China, South Korea, and Japan, participants in stalled talks in the North nuclear program over the unexpected announcement which comes shortly after the Northeast Asian country threatened to launch nuclear attacks on U.S. military bases in the region. North Korea's threat came as U.S. and South Korean forces carried out joint military drills, including near the maritime border between the two Koreas. The United States responded by deploying F-22 Raptor fighters.